Last year, I. Daddy, can you help me? Yeah, I'll help you. You look tired, girl. So last year, I put together an exhibition of five paintings. It's a show that I may be most proud of of all of the exhibitions I've created. And when I was at the opening, there were all these people that kept asking me, how long did it take you to do this? It must have taken you months, it must have taken you years. And the secret is, I did all of those paintings in two and a half months. How the hell did I do that? You see, I have two really young little girls. I adore everything about them. They take up all of my time. So I would imagine if you're watching this, you're probably curious about how to make paintings and how to be an artist when you've got little kids. Every waking moment has an urgent need or something that you have to do that's not making a painting. So I figured I'd go through my day and kind of explain where I come up with the time and see if it maybe helps you. My weekday, I pretty much get up every day at about 5, 5.30. And that usually starts shortly thereafter with the girls waking up, getting things ready for the day, making breakfast, milk in a show. Very important thing for my toddler. We'll go visit grandma and I'll go to work. The work day is pretty much like anybody else's work day. And then it's time to come home. We gotta have dinner put the house back together, decompress the girls, milk gonna show again, also very important. And then it's bedtime. Yes. No, we don't wanna go to bed. It's a process. When the girls are down for bed, that's when my day really starts because that's when I have time to make my art. I know that tomorrow I have to be up at 5.30 again. So I make the choice every day as to how much time I'm willing to trade sleep for art. It varies from day to day. During the weekend, my day is similar, but instead of work, I get an extra painting session during the day. Also, the mornings are always family time. There are some things that aren't accounted for in this schedule.
point is, it's a lot. I wish I could say that there was some magic bullet that made the limited time you have more effective or gave you unlimited energy to make art at any given hour, regardless of what your schedule has in it. The reality is, you gotta want it. You've gotta want it as much as you want air in your lungs. And if there's one thing that having kids and experiencing these times with my little ones does to actually fuel my life as an artist. My daughters are proud of the fact that I make art and they like seeing it and they like doing it. And that is the best fuel that life can give me. So I'm just gonna keep drinking it up What do you think? It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And it's a little banana. Yeah, it's bananas. And what's that animal? A kitty cat. Kitty cat. I love this. You love this? Mm -hmm. It's pretty. Can I buy one of those for me? <laughs> Will I buy one of those? Banana, a cat, or a painting? Okay, I'll get you a painting. <laughs>